Hi, I'm Hilary Talbot, acupuncture physician and clinical herbalist. Today I will be demonstrating some acupressure points to help treat allergies. There are two points located on the hand that I often use when treating allergies, whether with acupressure or acupuncture. The first point is large intestine four, located between the first and second bones of the hand at the high point of the muscle at the end of the crease. This point is clinically significant because it's the command point to the head. So generally when you experience allergies, you experience them in your head with sneezing, runny eyes, stuffed up nose. Um, so if that's the type of allergic response that you're having, this point is um, really beneficial. The other point is lung seven. And lung seven is found by this neat little trick of using both your hands, you lock your um, thumbs together, and where your pointer finger lands on the, um, this side of the arm is where lung seven is located. Dental manipulation to this point is helpful in activating the Wei Qi or the protective Qi. Um, so over time, using this point daily, let's say if you had chronic allergies, would actually be really effective as a preventative measure instead of waiting until it happens. And then two points on the face, which are great, our local points located here in the crease, especially if there's any nasal involvement, large intestine bitong, and then also bladder two. Bladder two is located on the medial side of the eyebrow in a sinus cavity, a little divot right here. And these are really effective for sneezing. So if you get into sneezing attacks and can't stop, um, I tell my patients to massage these points all the time. Sometimes it can help um, prevent like a massive sneeze attack by opening up the sinus cavities. I'm Hilary Talbot and that was acupressure for allergies.